G'day, I'm Malcolm from Woodwork and Machinery Services. Today I'm just going to give you a couple of tips on how to look after your tooling on a CNC machine. Um, today we're working with the Masterwood CNC machine which uses two types of tooling depending on the model that you have. Uh, you could use ISO tooling or HSK. So you'll probably recognise both of these. This one's the ISO tooling. The most important thing is to maintain the collar is free of any build up of dust or contaminants like rust that sort of thing so obviously if there's any rust build up on on this give it a very um, light uh, clean with some steel wool or, or um, some very fine wet and dry paper once you've got the tool clean of, of any dust or any uh, you know rust contaminants the best thing I like to advise my clients is to actually use some dry glide, you can see I'm using the CRC brand here and just a very light spray on the back of the, the cone itself the tool holder. What that does is it leaves a, a very light film uh, on the tool itself which stops any rust build up and also stops any, um, any dust and contaminants sticking to the tool itself. So on the HSK type same thing, this one's a, a fresh one out of a bag, so you can see it's um, basically got a lot of oil over it from, from new, so first thing you need to do is make sure you get rid of all the oil. You can use anything, I, as you can see Inox is my favourite um, pastime, and I use that for cleaning a lot of things, lubricating. When you're cleaning these tools, you can use everything from thinners through to uh, methylated spirits. But you can see on the inside of that, there's always a bit of a build-up of, of grease. The most important thing is when you've finished, make sure the tool is as dry as you can possibly get it. You don't want any wetness left behind from the oil or whatever solvent you're using. Once you've got that clean, Again, the best thing to do is around this surface here to stop any contaminants building up, rust, and just give it a lot, another light spray with that coating. So let that dry. Obviously any um, tooling, any collets you're going to use, make sure they're free of, of oil at the same time. The whole idea here is keeping things clean because obviously CNC machines can, are very reliable as long as you keep them clean. So in a nutshell that's um, how you look after your tooling and um, just keeping them clean and making sure your machine gives you a good life.